bless you. Praise God, yes. Lord bless Brother Darrell. God bless Amen. our brother. Amen. Amen. Thank God. Aren't, aren't, aren't you glad you're in a place where you feel the Spirit of God? Yes, oh, yes, yes, yes. Not Amen. only the Spirit of God, but you can hear the truth come forth. Yes. Amen. Amen. There's not very many places where that can happen. <coughs> Uh, Brother Marlowe was talking about some things that has been happening lately, and that, that's really set me on fire. Yes. And I, kind of like him, I can't keep my mouth shut about it. No. <laughs> and where I've been, it wasn't received as well as it was yeah. tonight, Brother. <laughs> I was uh, told that I need to be careful. I could get in a lot of trouble, and I said, well, I'm already there. I'm already there. Yeah. It's wonderful to be in a place to where the truth of God can come forth and you can know the age that you're living in and the day that you're living in because if you don't, you can't prepare for it. Amen. 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 You know how blessed you are to have a ministry oh, that's right. that will tell you the truth? Amen. I've been in a place where they're, they're, they act like they're afraid to do that. Yes. You don't want to rock the boat. You don't want to keep things stirred up. You, don't want to be up. you know, I imagine when uh, Abraham left where he was and he brought his nephew Lot with him. I'm not too sure about Lot. When I read about him and see what he done, I think he just followed along with his uncle just for just for the benefits of it, you know. Because he got to the place where when he had to choose, he went down into the city. And he comes so close to that, those those five cities that were nothing but immorality. Of. Right. There was nothing virtuous about any of it. No. And Lot lived among that so much, and his family got tainted by it. Right, man. And Lot did. Right. And when the uh, angels let him out, his wife still longed for that. Come on, yeah, right. Oh, yeah. She turned back and looked at it, <coughs> and turned to a pillow of salt. Right. right, and they they wandered in a cave. You know, they thought everything had gone up. Now, they they had listened to their uncle. They knew what was going on. Right, but they lived among that so long that they couldn't change. Come on, yes. yes. Oh, God. Aren't you glad that yes. you're in a place to where you hear the truth Amen. and you know that that doesn't Amen. become a part of you? I'm so glad because the world is going that way. Come on, so going that way. Amen. Man loves darkness more than he does light. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. He does. Those, uh, I watched the program, and it must have been the same one that Brother Marlowe watched. Yes. Uh, I know some of the people that took part in it. Yes. Brother, I'm telling you, I, I, I used to wonder how in the world was a beast going to get all of those people that are, that, that are going to help fulfill that. Yes. Oh, he's doing it. And he's doing it now. Amen. He's doing it now. Right. The uh, the prosperity preachers are all lining up behind you. Oh yes. The Pentecostal preachers yes. are all lining up behind you. Right. But the, the, the Protestant preachers. Seven. Those things are happening before our eyes today. You know, when we see in the scriptures where the three Hebrew children yes. were cast into the fire. Come on. Yes. They watched that furnace be made before they were cast into it. Yes, the they did. Yes. Brother, are you watching those things? That furnace is being made today. Yes, it is. That system is being made today. Amen. And there will come a time in the in the very near future Amen. when you deliver a message like Brother Marlowe did today. If, uh, if he was in Indiana and that happened and someone become offended by it, right. someone of that gender, they could take a warrant out for him. Oh, yes, they hate yes. crime. Yes. 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 About two-thirds of our states already have that on their books. Exactly. And the federal, the federal government does. Yes. Yes. If, if you say anything and sway people against anything, it doesn't make any difference what it is, exactly. then they can take you to court for that. Man, you know, I'm, I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> because I know that that same Holy Ghost, that same Spirit of God, same Spirit yes. that healed my mother when she had 30 days to live, yeah. I know it's still in existence today. Right. And it's the thing that's going to take care of us. Right. It's called the Ark of God. Get yeah. in. Yeah. Don't get out of the 
the boat now. Right. Get in the boat. You know, get in that ark. This is an ark. This is a light in a land of darkness. We're in amongst the light. There are not very many churches where you can walk in and feel that wonderful spirit of God begin to uh, perpetrate your very being. It's not something you just feel and you're gone, but it's something that you take with you. At 2 o'clock at night when you wake up, that's on my mind. It is mine. And I know it's yours. No matter where you're at, we're to live a holy life. I, I, you know, when, when we left here before, I had no intention of moving down here. I no. really did. Was it in your I, I told Brother Marlow when I left. You told me. And uh, he said, well, maybe God will deal with you. I said, well, he'll, he'll have to because I'm not leaving those hills. I love Jerry. You know, <laughs> God. God. And I got back home and uh, I was praying. And I went to sleep and I had a dream, a very peculiar dream. I don't dream often. Hey, Brother Mike was in our church. I kid him. I call him Joseph because he dreams a lot. But I don't. And I had a dream that me and four other brethren that are here was walking down a highway. Come on. And the highway behind us was like smooth glass. You could see a reflection in it. But in front of us, there was debris on the road in different places. And we were walking abreast of each other, and when we'd come up to something that was on the road, one of us would pick it up and throw it off. And when you did, that road got smooth just like the rest of it. And I looked over to the side of the road, and there was a sign <laughs> on the highway. It said, the Highway of Holiness. Brother, that dream stirred me deeply. That dream stirred me deeply. From now on, I'm not going to back up on what we need to do to live, to be righteous in the children of God. The world will reject that. They're going to reject you for that. But don't worry about it. Like the brother said, the puppet master controls it. Yes. He's going to make a way for you. All right. That's right. He's going to make a place for you. All right. <laughs> we're to be seen and read of all men. Yes. And if we're going to be, and then when you have Jesus as your head, yes. or man will be the difference. Amen, right. amen. Brother, we don't have no room for the flesh here. Amen. We don't have any room in this assembly for the flesh. Amen. Oh, right. If you want the flesh, you go to some of these other assemblies amen. around here. And Brother Marlowe can tell you after visiting some of them, yes. there's more flesh in the service than there is the Spirit of God. God. It's because it's slowly eroded over a period of time. Yes. There was a time when William Souders taught holiness or hell yes, the did. same way the Wesley brothers did. Yes, did. Brother, that is still true today. It's, it's not wrong. But when you see what happened, you see what our nation has come to, where it, it, it homosexuality it's supposed to be a normal thing I got it's it. not normal in my book Amen. it's not normal in our church Amen. those things we don't have time for those things and then we see those things that the way that they're happening because the leaders have condoned that yes you watch a children's uh, program on on television now no matter what you watch, there's a homosexual family in that program. Yeah, we sure should have aware. Because they're telling you that that's normal. No, that's not normal. Amen. That's not normal. That's not the way God set Amen. it up. That's exactly that wasn't the way that the God set it up. Preacher, brother. Amen. <clears throat> but as we begin to go, brother, we have to be holy. Amen. We have to Amen. be holy. Do you want Jesus to heal you? Amen. Do you want that wonderful Holy Ghost to begin? And, and brother, from that dream, the only thing that I have left is that we have to have holiness. Yes, we must have. I woke up the next morning, I reflected on the dream, and I told my daughter-in-law, I said, well, it looks like I'm going to move to Florida. Lord. I said, now, Lord, I've got this great big old house here. I think it's, what, 14, 15 rooms, Tom, something like that. It's a big old place. I said, now I can't leave at, with this place here. I'm going to have to sell it if I leave. 
Lord, if it's really you, you know, if it's really you, Lord, after agreeing like that, I'm still questioning God. Lord, if it's really you, <coughs> let me sell this place right away for just what I ask. We called a realtor the next day. He come over and we got all the information and everything. And he left. And I sold the house the next day for just what I was praying for. Yeah. Yeah. I said, yes, Lord. Yeah. Yes, Lord. Yeah. I know there's great things going on. Yeah. And I know I'm going to be all able to be a part of it, all even right. if it's just holding the door open. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> the only big eye in this assembly is Jesus Christ. He's the only one. He's the only one. Brother John, he's over there in Fort Charlotte, the only eye over there is Jesus. You know, we, we, we have nothing else to work for. But we don't have anything without Christ. No matter where you're at. Now, I've been a lot of places. To, these people that Brother Marlowe talked about when Tom helped him go to the airport, I was having trouble with these same people. And I was sitting, and, and uh, it was right after my wife died, and they, they were just walking around me. Nobody was. I mean, it's like I wasn't even there. And I looked up to God, and tears coming down my heart because these, this, that was my family. Or I thought it was. Yeah. And I looked up to God and I began to cry out. I said, oh, God, what have I done that's so wrong that my brothers and sisters would reject me? And it's kind of like thunder hit my head. And I could feel the voice of God and he said, you're my child. You belong to me. No matter where you're at or who you're with, you're mine. I said, thank you, Lord. Thank you. Since then, it's been a lot easier in my spirit. I want to be able to be whatever we need. Yeah, I didn't. We didn't. We didn't come down here uh, to ride. We come down here to work. You're a part. You're and a part, Brother Marlow. Whatever we need. Amen. Whatever you think we need to do, you just let us know. I'll call and it's done. Say, God, and it's done. Uh, you're part of us. Brother, <laughs> brother, God put Brother Marlowe in my heart many, many, many years ago. And he's never left there. Him Thank you, Father. They, they, they've never left my heart at all. No. So I know that God has a great work. This is wonderful, the spirit that you have. Amen. 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 <clears throat> to, to feel that spirit. Amen. And see that work. It, it's so great because you can't find that anywhere. Else. Amen. Amen. You've got a form. The scripture says they have the form of God. They deny the power there. It's not there. It, it, it's a, a show like that. You know what? Horses, pony, act they used to have, but still got it. Yes. Brother, it's not there. There ain't any room for God no more. There's no room to follow the Spirit. My God. There used to be signs, and I had one on the on my Bible. Uh, Stand at home and said, Watch the spirit. Watch the spirit. Right. Brother, that's all we have to watch that. Amen. With the word of God is necessary. Amen. You can't be saved without it, but you can't be saved without the spirit of God either. Amen. Amen. It takes that blend that comes there. You've got the blend here. Amen. But you've got the spirit of God that comes in. You've got the word of God that flows like a river. That's because of that that uh, that foundation that the wood, hay, and stubble is not there. Amen. Amen. But it's that pure foundation of Jesus Christ. Amen. Yes. Y'all pray for us. Yes. We all pray. pray. Keep us in mind. My old body is wore out, but it doesn't make any difference anymore. I can get you a new. It don't make any difference anymore. Amen. I know that I can do what God wants me to do. Amen. 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 Amen.